yeah, I'm gonna be doing a video. Oh, sorry. <laughs> of the new labels that I got from Westfield. And yeah, let's just get straight into it. That was the shortest intro ever. Like, yeah. <laughs> I just really get when you get straightforward so I can show you some of the stuff. And the first thing I will show you is my new pet case. I'm addicted with this. And this fits my stuff perfectly. Instead of me having like one whole section in my triple pencil case filled with nothing. So. I just thought I would get this time I got a short pencil case that would fit everything and maybe even still have some more space just in case anything extra and I got this now this is scented and it smells to me like pineapple there was a purple and a pink one I chose blue because blue is my life right now I'm in a phase with pink and blue equals cotton candy so most of my stuff here is pink or blue or purple no pink plus blue equals purple especially for their pastel i'm just in a phase i think i got that from andrea alexandria with her slime i forgot what the name of it was but you should go watch her videos i'm not even joking like they're legit just so satisfying i can link like at le no i can't link but i can say at least three people who would satisfy you to hell with their slime videos like i can if you want me guys to um just show me down the description down below. But let's get on to the video. Wait, that wasn't the shortest. I literally just destroyed it. But um, first things I have. I'm sorry if I show you these twice again. And if I have extra time, I will go back with my old stuff. Because why not? P.S. This has a small pouch here when you open it. And I just keep my adorable mini rubbers. I spent at least twenty five pounds in Smiggle to get my new stuff. This pencil case itself was twelve pound fifty. Um, I just went to, yeah. Let's just say I got those. I got everything here, and I had seven pounds here because I had thirty one pounds something. Wait, no, I used twenty four pounds. So first things I have are these um, these amazing um ink pens, and yes, they are ink, and I've got four colors because i will need these colors most of all so let me have pink and some pastels and stuff i was like no i am looking for what i need not what i want so i did not take those but yeah i got this super thing i cute thing it's just so adorable this was two pounds i bought it off of selling and well yeah so I then had two of these. She had a pink one, and I just just the purple one because it was just cute to someone else. And she got these for Christmas, but she gave it to me for two pounds. And we all also learned her pens. Anyway, we got this. And, yeah. That was it's just super cute. It adds something here. It's multi coloured. This is like another one of those. Just it's like a pink metallic one. Okay, so cute, it has four different colours. Be polarized. Be original. And I just love this rubber. Seller has the exact same thing and it's been scratched up by my pens, but I don't care. I'm just gonna rub off the original and then rub off be polarized. But I'll do that later if so I don't want much time. Now I needed this um, more than most things in my pen squares. Like I needed this new rubber and sharpen up Snip it. look and sharpen it here and then we close it and we'll... it's just a lot more technical than my old one This is the colour changing pencil for yourself. You guys see that? This one goes into white. I tried showing you guys. I'm not sent to this one. These are much more better in person, but I'm sorry. This was only a pound, and I think I should have bought this ages ago. Look. It's 
a black pen and I needed one desperately, so I got this and it, I just think it's completely worth it. Now, I did not pay for these, my aunt bought these for the church and well, she gave me one and then somebody else and then Selen swapped for me for one. And this one is blue, dark blue ink, which is what I need as well. And I wanted two dark blue ink normal pens and then one ink pen and then same for the black. Um, so yeah. This dark blue, this is black, um, and this is my spy pen. Selen had to give me her lid because well, I'm not swapping for a spy pen without a lid. Um, and I think she, I lost, I lost it when I swapped with her ages ago. I gave it for her for free, and then I swapped it back. And yeah, guys, we do a lot of swapping. Most of the stuff in my first case is Selen's originally, and most of the stuff in her first case is mine originally. But I need this, so yeah. This was just a spy pen, and the ink does not work anymore. It's completely dried. It's a rock right now. This was like one of our first ones. I remember when I got my first one, I lost it in my coat pocket, and the lid was on it, so it dried up completely. And that was just the day when I had bought it. And then Selene gave me this one, and I swapped it back with her because I lost the lid, and I gave it to her for free. And well, I swapped it back now for another lid of hers. But I, I can't use the spy pen bit, but I can use this as like a reading in the dark thing because the light still works. Sorry if I blind you. Okay, so. These are like scented pencils. Unicorn scented. Cafe scented. Cookie scented. And they smell amazing when combined. It's like a bit, oh my gosh, I don't even know how to describe it. And this does, this is just a cheating pencil, like all your timetables are like written out. And I just find it's amazing. But when you sharpen it, you lose some. Luckily, the easiest ones are at the bottom, so the harder ones are just at the top. And it's just, it's just life. I didn't get this too long ago. And the rubber is really jiggly. And it's just a super cute pencil. She had a rainbow one, but I prefer. I'm, you guys know that I'm into the purple, pink, and blue stuff. So I just have to get her purple. And last of all, but definitely not least, is the scissors. And that is all my new stuff got right in front of me on the table, glass table. And my nails in it, which sounds horrible, so I'll stop. Um, I keep the small rubbers in a small pouch because, well, yeah. It's like I don't want to destroy it or anything or lose them. So yeah, let me just show you my old stuff. Me and Selen, I swapped Selen an old some. I swapped Selen some old pencils and stuff for these two new pens. But I swapped loads of old pencils and just Selen will swap. So I did for these two. She gave me this Apple one by herself for free because we were just like in that best friend huggy moment while we were just giving each other nice stuff free i I got, I got two in a pack and i gave her one as well but yeah and then i got this and she gave me this pink one for some for some old pencils and my old pink one um my old pink one was not working she was clearly new of that so don't say that i'm a cheat because she clearly knows that it didn't work, and, but I swapped it with her for some nice pencils, even though they were not the newest and latest. I literally just got like the day before, but like they were some good pencils. And I reminded her that it doesn't matter if they're all bling and have like different coloured gold bars on it. Well, if it's a gold bar, it's gonna be gold, not another colour, but like it doesn't matter if the pencil's multi coloured with like gold bits sticking out of it no it matters how well it works because if that pen don't work what you're going to use it for yo you've basically denied its purpose so i just reminded her that and yeah this is a glow stick that's super old i'm just showing you guys my old stuff and then this video is gone i'll do my outro and that's it this is my ruler just want to show you guys i'm proud of this this was the ruler i got when i first went to smuggle my triple and i got my triple pets case as well triple pets case my mum can give it to whoever she wants um or use for herself. Um, I don't. I just feel proud of this. Selene has m jacked hers up, and I've had mine for longer than her, so mine is still in one piece. I'm happy. I'm proud. I'm proud because I'm not the type. I'm the type of person that would like put a gold bar somewhere. Two days after, where's my gold bar? Like, and then and then when I do find it, it's probably scratched up and half of the gold paint is off of it, or like digs of digs of the gold is <laughs> gold paint. It's real gold, and like part of the gold is like chunks are missing from it and stuff so the fact that 
this ruler is still in one piece i'm happy that was 2.75 by the way so my parents will not be happy for a small plastic ruler that extends for which is 15 that extends to a 30 inch they will not be very happy if i pick my up next i have these and you guys have known it's for ages these are just like my designing like mess around pens i could just use them to school from board like let's doodle a nice flower let's doodle love heart pattern let's doodle a dog let's doodle and I, I i'm really familiar with these pens i use them all the time and my friends absolutely love them because um i have a friend some friends who are really close to me and almost the same as me in art like they love art just as much as i do so we just like doodling with those pens and yeah they have theirs i have mine we will share and that's it um so i've got Benka blue highlighters because who doesn't need highlighters for school i mean you just need to get the work you need to you need to highlight the bits that you don't understand like you need them and last but not least i have got my calculator boom, 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 boom. and I just want to show you these rubbers. They are all scented. There's pineapple ones, strawberry ones, berry smoothie ones, and then there's another type. Watermelon. Strawberry watermelon, berry smoothie, and pineapple. And they smell amazing, like a fruit salad, but all combined. And guys, that is my video. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Please watch more of my videos if you're not familiar with me. And if you're new, please subscribe. It will mean the world to me. And I'm just really happy, guys. I'm just, I'm, it's just a good day for me right now. So, um, yeah, please be supportive. I don't like hate because I will literally just report you. I would report you. I would not hate on you because I'm not, I'm not the type of person that would stoop to your level. But I would just report you at the end of you. You can go elsewhere if you want to hate. In fact, no, don't go elsewhere. Just keep your hate to yourself because I'm pretty sure other YouTubers wouldn't want someone else being hurt. People are suicidal because of this and do all types of horrible things to themselves and other people because of you. So if you're one of those haters, either go to a hatred class and learn to keep it down or just, just come out of social media and hate yourself because there's no point of you hating other people if you just feel good for yourself because it's just not fair but anyway good for yourself sorry i need to learn my english it's holidays guys the english te my english teaches out of my head yes so um <laughs> so um yeah guys it's kind of just my video hope you enjoyed it if you didn't enjoy it i'm sorry about that tell me what you would like me to do in my next video if it's possible i will try and do it if it's not possible and try and link something that you know would be possible for me but i might i know i keep making promises that i don't always keep but boom boozle cha bean boozle challenge i have in my local um shop but the problem with it is whenever i up upload it means it'll take forever to do it and like it doesn't match the 15 minute requirement and my parents are not ready to be paying money every like a month or so for it so i don't even know how much you have to pay but my parents just don't want to do it. We have, we're just really busy as a family. We have better things to use with that money. So we try, that's why most of my videos I try to keep to a limit of 15 minutes. Because that's as much as YouTube will allow. So guys, I am so sorry. But so sorry you had to see an end to this. But guys, please enjoy my videos. And P.S. Ellen wants to start her own YouTube channel. Should I should she start her own youtube channel or do you guys want us to continue doing youtube videos together or do you want her to start her own youtube channel and i start bringing different friends in or should we continue with a youtube channel we both do and we both bring our different friends in i think i prefer we both keep doing youtube channel or maybe guys just tell me what you would like would you like her to leave or stay um your guys choices um the majority of people who want whichever part will get it um i can do videos with other friends or i can do solo channel or she could join me or she could do videos with her other friends or she could do a solo channel if she if however she does do a solo channel and you guys want it to happen that way then sorry just talk way too much but guys yeah you get what i mean right then um 
I will just tell you what her YouTube channel is. Now I have to go because I only have one second and bye. <laughs>